Hey, what's up? John Sonmez here from simpleprogrammer.com. So I want to do a video today talking about waiting for things to be done. So this is one of those things that I, I used to uh, do all the time and I still catch myself every once in a while. I think we all tend to fall into this trap of, of waiting for things to be done, waiting for things to be finished, uh, to, to get to the weekend, to get through uh, the work day, to get through the workout, uh, to lose the weight, to finish with the the diet, whatever it is, finish college, get that raise, whatever it is that you're waiting for. And, you know, I just finished my workout here. And just to give you a little bit of perspective of, of what I'm talking about here, my typical week is two hour workouts, seven days a week, except for Wednesday, it's a four hour workout. And so <laughs> if I'm waiting to be done, if I'm like, oh, wait, wait, wait till I finish that, uh, I'm gonna have a pretty, pretty miserable life. It's because it's never gonna be done, right? Like, it, it's just that's what it is every single day, every single week. It's never done, and so the thing is, like, you know, and I did this a lot of times in my life when I was trying to, you know, build up my real estate and get retired. I was waiting for that to be done, right? I was waiting for me to reach the point where I didn't have to work anymore, where I didn't have to do a job and I could just have my time when I was getting through a plural site course I was doing, I was waiting for that to be done. When I was trying to lose weight, I was waiting for that to be done, waiting for the diet to be done, right? Waiting for whatever to be done. Heck, when I was going to work every day, how many of you can relate to this? You're waiting for lunch. You're waiting for five o'clock for the day to be over, or you're waiting for the weekend, right? And the thing is like, when you live your life that way, when you're waiting for things to be done, uh, it's destructive because you're missing most of life because most of life will be waiting for things to be done Most of life is not going to be the end and also the end becomes disappointing when you finally get there, right? Then you're like, oh, what was that all about? Because hey, you're there and, uh, and, and now what, right? The point of this is this, right? Is that I like that quote that's like, uh, you know, the, the warrior knows that every, every day the, the battle begins anew and that's so true. It's like if you're you have to realize, you have to just adopt the mindset that, you know, every day you're going to fight the battle anew. Every day there's going to be new struggles, new challenges to overcome. There's going to be new pain, new things to go through, and it's never, ever going to be done. It's never going to be done no matter what you're doing. And, you know, that's how I look at it, right? So, again, if I looked and I said, man, I got to do two hour workouts for every, every single day. When does this finish, right? Uh, I could get really really despondent, I could get really disappointed and say, oh man, that's horrible, that's, that's crazy. But instead, I look at it as every day, you know, this is part of the day, this is a challenge, it's never gonna be done, it's never gonna be finished, and it's okay because that's what life is. Life is that battle, it is that that quest that is never finished. And if it were finished, it'd be boring, it'd be boring shit. You, it'll be finished when you're dead, right? Maybe, maybe. But. But that's, that's a key, right? So when you look at it from that perspective, okay, it, it's all about managing expectations, right? Because see, when your expectation is that you're waiting for it to be finished, when your expectation is, man, can't wait for the weekend because then I can really enjoy myself, or man, can't wait till the, the clock hits five because then I can go home, and you're waiting, 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 right? Then you're impatient. It's annoying. Life is a burden to you. But when you're ready, when you're expecting, when your expectation is, yeah, the shit's gonna come and it's gonna come every single fucking day and I'm gonna have to deal with it every single day and I'm gonna have to fight the battle and it's never gonna be over and I'm always gonna be fighting the battle every single day when I wake up in the morning. When your expectation is that, that changes things, it shifts things. Now you're ready to tackle day, now you're ready to face the challenges. Now you can do a two hour workout every day and never miss a day and never get tired of that shit and keep on doing it and keep on pushing on because you expect that because you know that's what's coming you're not waiting for the end you're not waiting for it to stop so i am going to point you to one resource here i've talked about this a lot but the very first chapter in this book get the the actual kindle or print version of it don't get the audio version because the audio version is different it's called uh, the way of the superior man by by david data and in the very first chapter of the book, it addresses exactly what I told you here. Uh, it does it very, very well. Uh, definitely a concept that is very, very difficult uh, to, to get into your mind. But once you understand that concept, once you really get that, uh, it, it changes because it changes your expectation. And when you change your expectation, uh, you, you, you change the way that you, 
you live your life. So, all right, that's all I got for you today. If you like this video, if you like this video, click that subscribe button below. Talk to you next time, take care.